Hey guys, welcome to a new vlog. I'm at the beautiful Monroe Boutique and Hotel. I can listen to all of the birds. It's so beautiful. And I'm here with Sorbet today. Initially, I didn't want to vlog. I brought my camera and I was like, okay, I'll see what it looks like and see if there's like a lot of music playing because most of the time at events, it's really difficult to vlog with music and stuff. So there isn't much music playing. So first we are going to get color matched and then receive like our perfect foundation from Sorbet. And then I think we're going to have breakfast. Wait, do you want to say hi to the vlog? <laughs> Life is funny and sometimes strange. It still um, turns out the way you think. But if you want some good advice, I can offer this small wink. You find that. A little goes a long way. Are you hungry? Yes, oh my god, I am starving. I am so ready to like mukbang it up. I'm so hungry. <laughs> mukbang it up. <laughs> mukbang it up. Oh my god. A little goes a long way. A little goes a long way for love. A little goes a long way. A little goes a long way. A little goes a long way for love. So lucky as to find someone with whom to spend your every day. Okay, <laughs> I am home now. I've been home for a little while. Um, we just like did a little bit of laundry, I worked a little bit, and we tidied up because we didn't have a chance to tidy up before we left. Um, I feel it's really important to just keep our space clean because we do live here we work here we chill here <laughs> we just i feel like it's always a mess but i feel like if we just spend a little bit of time every single day just to tidy up and keep up with the laundry then it won't become like a huge mess so i feel like i'm always cleaning and always organizing but i feel like it's it's become a routine now but um i didn't spend like a lot of time at the sorbet event today um i also didn't record much i think i just i was so in the moment um i listened to a couple of the speakers and i just really loved what they were saying so i completely forgot about <laughs> vlogging it um but we had the best time um it was so nice that like the marketing team from sorbet came up to me and they were like we handpicked everyone and we like love that you came and they were just so nice and so generous they gifted us with a huge bag full of products how beautiful is this bag by the way it's a vanity bag from sorbet obviously and um we could pack everything in our little bag and i thought i would do a little haul for you guys and um we are gonna have dinner with our friends fad and simile so i thought i would sure just like freshen up my makeup a little bit my hair is looking fine i just need a little bit of hairspray um but i thought i would like just freshen up my makeup and maybe show you guys what we got so we got a whole bunch of brushes um i told my friend um sarah that i was really excited <laughs> because i have so many brushes and i'm glad i have so many brushes but they are not clean so i've been rotating four brushes that i've just been like you know cleaning as i go and just spraying a little bit of alcohol so i'm excited to have like a new set of brushes up until i eventually spend time to like just wash all of those so let me just quickly open all of these okay so the first brush that i'm going to start with is the powerful stuff powder brush it's really really soft so i'm just gonna take i know i already touched it on my face but i just want to like spray a little bit of alcohol onto it i don't know guys i really enjoyed sitting with you guys and just chatting and doing my makeup and it's almost 
it's like sitting with a friend um so i hope you guys feel the same way i got this powder powder to you um it's a loose powder and i got the shade <coughs> light i just need to open this quickly so i just really enjoyed like sitting with you guys in the previous vlog and just like doing my makeup it's really old school i mean that's how i started off vlogging it's because i didn't know anything else beside makeup and um i've gotten into like so much of lifestyle vlogging that i forget about the makeup and today i realized how much i miss like talking about makeup and skincare so my makeup needs to freshen up. I did this makeup at 8 o'clock this morning. It is now like almost 5 o'clock. So it's still looking okay. But I mean, I've like laid on brain shoulder and it's all like messed up. So, how stunning, you guys. How stunning is this? It comes with a little, like a little poof thingy. And it has a seal right over there. So I don't know, I feel like I should kind of, there we go, it messes up the mirror completely, but I prefer dusting a little bit of powder on my skin like this, rather than like pressing it, but I'm going to try it with this little sorbet thing. I like the colour actually, I was actually scared. I'm just gonna set around my face for now. Sorry, I'm using the viewfinder as a mirror. I want to use a little bit of the foundation they gave me for just the center of my face. This is the Sorbet Bare Faced Vitamin A, C, and E with SPF 6 liquid foundation. Um, I got the shade Buff, so I'm just gonna use. A little bit and then I'm gonna use this brush over here the contour me highlight and sculpting brush it has two little ends so I think I'm gonna use this side to just I know I'm like applying makeup over makeup but I mean I wanted to freshen up my makeup anyway because I didn't want to take it all off and start over So hopefully you guys are not completely grossed out. I mean, to be honest, we all live busy lives. Well, I hope we all live busy lives. And sometimes you do your makeup in the morning and you're going out somewhere at night. And you don't have time to like reapply everything. So you kind of want something that is able to just touch up really well. I like this color on me. It's a good color. Okay, I know I see powder here already, but I'm going to try and do a little bit here, like very lightly. That powder is very lightweight. I like this brush, actually. I love, like, a dual-ended brush because I feel like it's, um... Very like user friendly, I would say. Um, okay, now I'm gonna try with this little spongy. Ooh, a lot of product comes out. I kind of wish. I feel like this is gonna darken everything. Oh my word, that's actually beautiful. That is beautiful. I feel like it gives a little bit of coverage as well. It's difficult to see in this mirror because there's like makeup everywhere. Okay. sorry i really like that um where is where's my makeup wipes i have a little tea 
to so I can just wipe off. I just needed like a little bit to be honest, but I think this color is perfect. So you can't even tell I had foundation on. Okay, next I have two little um, eyeshadow brushes. Both of them are pretty flat. I'm not like the biggest fan of these like really flat brushes. Focus back on me. <laughs> um, but I feel like let me give them a try. One is the concealer brush and one is a shading eye brush. Um, this is the eye one, but I feel like I'm going to use this one. Um, or maybe I should just use the brush. No, I think I'm going to skip these brushes. Um, I'm just going to use a little bit of my bronzer, the Hoola from Benefit. And I'm just going to do a little bit of the eyes, just fix that up. I didn't play with the products too much in the masterclass because I already had makeup on. Um, I honestly didn't know that it was going to be like a hands-on makeup class. But um, we all kind of just played with the products. Now I want to use this exact... Oh no, I think I should use this other brush. Where is it? Oh... <laughs> It was like right under my nose. So I want to use the dual ended one. I want to use like the contour side. Guys, I really like that powder. It looks healthy. Like it gives a little bit of color to the skin. Which I don't really have with my Lancome um long time no shine because it's translucent so it gives like a little bit of a, a white sheen type of feel but it's not like white it just it looks white because it's translucent um but i actually prefer this solway one let me not talk too quickly <laughs> just now i don't end up liking it but um it literally refreshed my makeup so beautifully Especially like applying more liquid and more powder on already set makeup. Because I set my makeup this morning. So that's a little bit of a, a tricky one. Okay. And then I feel like I just need to touch up my brows. I want to show you guys this brush. How cool. It's a neat and tidy eyebrow and lash brush it comes with this little pouch that's really cute so you can brush these are metal i don't know what is used for what well, let me use this this little mirror looks better Ooh. That's nice. Get a little bit of the old product out. And then pop this bad boy back on. And then I'm going to put it in my little pouch. That is so cute. I like that. I'm going to go in with my Benefit... Um, is it gimme gimme brow um just to set everything in place again i feel like my face is separating a little bit over here but to be honest with you if i look from this distance which People would probably, they won't like go up to me like this. But I feel like that powder, this powder literally fixed that for me. Um, what else did I get in this makeup bag? I feel like there's more things that I can quickly try with you guys. Um, they have this eyeshadow palette. Again, like, I don't know. I know people that 
that they don't know how to apply makeup or don't like no that's bad i can't say that um people that probably don't apply makeup as often or people that don't um have like a preference in like how they apply or the type of brushes they would like to use use these like my mom used to use these my gran uses these so like i understand why they still like include these but i feel like you can create like a small little brush that size with an actual like bristle effect so that we can actually use it because my finger works a lot better than those little spongies. So I'm just gonna do a little bit with copper. It's a beautiful shade. I'm not the biggest like eyeshadow girl, if I have to be honest with you. But I like a a bronzy, like very effortless swept kind of lid for every day and um sarah and i really really liked this it's a shimmer and glow shimmer bronzer um but i feel like it's more like a blush so i'm definitely gonna use it comes with a beautiful little protector i feel like i need to use the same i'm gonna use the same brush i used for my um bronzing so it's quite pink I don't know if you guys can tell but it's quite pink but it's almost like a bobby brown shimmer brick so I'm just gonna mix all of them together oh wow I love I love I love I love it has a little bit of shimmer a little bit of a glow oh wow stunning 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 i like this definitely love that here's a mascara i have mascara on this is way out lashes i feel like i should just maybe oh no i've got way too much mascara on already maybe just ooh. Oh, did you see what happened? Let me try and flick this off. Okay, got that mascara. And then brow shape and highlight. No, this is not it. I mixed the packaging. Um, I've got a little brow shape and highlight which i'm not even gonna uh, i don't know i'm very particular when it comes to my brow products because i like a very very thin yeah no this is not it this is for someone with a very thick brow and just wants to like fill it in a little bit but if you like a fluffy feather brow, nope, I don't really like this. Brows ability, brow shaper and highlighter. I prefer a very thin um, brow pencil with mine, like this. I prefer, there's so many that I like. I like Elizabeth Arden, I like Benefit, I like Revlon, but this is the kind of product that i like very very thin pencil with a little spoolie on the other side so that i can kind of brush it in between um so i think those are like that's like one of the only things that i don't really like um and then they gave me a lipstick oh i like this lip liner it's actually a really beautiful lip liner it's like a lip duo um in the shade 01k7 i think So it has like a darker side that you can use for like shading and then i'm just going to finish it off with um a little gloss this is from inglot it's a clear
gloss and um yeah, i think that's everything that i got i also got a little waterless hand sanitizer which with the coronavirus hitting south africa the most important thing is to keep your hands clean <laughs> um i don't know if that's the important, most important thing but that's what i read in a little article um so yeah i'm gonna get dressed and then i think this is the end of the vlog i don't think i'm gonna bring you guys along to um our dinner i just want to relax tonight i just want to like chill a little bit tomorrow's friday um yeah this week just went by so quickly we had a bunch of events and i feel like my week always goes by so quickly when we have events oh i wanted to do a little bit of um, setting spray i don't know if sorbet has a setting spray um but i tried this out yesterday the wet and wild natural finish accidentally got it in my eyes this morning and it burns like hell so like keep your eyes closed kids okay now my floor is full of makeup and now i need to clean all of this up um but i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and i'll see you guys in the next one Mwah.